Hi, everyone. I'm coming to you live on my YouTube channel. This is the first time we're doing this as our beauty mingle. So um, I'm really excited to, um, to be here with you all and to share with you. And I just, you know, want to say um, welcome. This is an amazing uh, evening. We've got lots of great information for you. Um, so I'm going to just give you a little bit of instruction, though, because we are on um, StreamYard. And so in order for me to see your comments, and that's how you get into the drawing, I need you to give StreamYard some um, permission, right? So see right here on the on the screen, make sure you give permission to StreamYard so I can see your comments. Um, and it's it'll be over in the chat. So if you type something in the chat, it might ask for permission, say yes to that. You're not you're not signing away your firstborn. You're just giving me permission to see your comments, okay? Because we're using this platform to speak to you on YouTube, and I'm very excited um, to introduce our first speaker. So um, you might want to get your notes out. Um, and in the comments, let's do this first thing. In the comments, type who you are and whether you're a consultant or a guest and what city you're watching from, because we love to, to know where you're watching, where you're um, YouTubing from. We, we want to see where you're at. And um, I do already see one comment in the chat right before we started. So um, if you, you need to put your name, if you're a consultant or guest, if you're a guest, put the consultant who invited you. We want to, um, you know, praise her and thank her for inviting you, uh, for opening up, the, you know, to watch our show. <laughs> and um, I'm going to bring our first speaker on and we're going to basically what we're going to talk to you about is order of applications. Um, we have actually uh, tons of products. And if you like me love all the Mary Kay line, you're using a lot of them, right? And it kind of gets overwhelming. Hey, Jamel. Hey, Jamila. It gets overwhelming that, um, you know, like what order do we put all these in? And so we thought, let's go through how to do that, right? Let's go through um, what the products do and the order that you use them in. So get your notebook out and take some notes. And then maybe you'll hear about some products you've not yet tried. Maybe you'll hear about some that, um, you know, you are currently using, but you're not quite sure when to use them. And um, hey, B. Hey, Melody, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for being a guest of Maria. I, so the consultants love it when you put who they're from because we can shout them out. So definitely um, type in the chat your name if you're a guest or consultant and where you're YouTubing from. Okay, we'd love to see that. And I'm going to bring on our first speaker. And we have some really good giveaways, but that's going to be at the end. So make sure you type in the chat anything that you really love, stand out. Also, I have a prize for the chat chatty Kathy. Okay. So this is something we always did with zoom. I'm going to do it with this as well. Okay. So our chatty Kathy is the person who comments the most, right? So you, maybe you love that product. Maybe you use it. Maybe um, it cleared up your acne. Maybe it got rid of a scar. Maybe it gave you, you know, baby soft skin, whatever. Type the comment in the chat um, when she is, you know, when the products are being talked about, or, um, you know, if you learn a new tip, Hey, Teresa, good to see you. And it was so fun. I got to see these consultants this past weekend. And so um, I'm, I'm just really excited to bring all this information to you. So get your notebooks out because you'll want to write this down. We have giveaways for the consultant with the most guests. We have a giveaway for the chatty Kathy of the night. And we have a prize for the guest, a product prize for the guest. So, um, you know, you'll definitely want to um, pay attention, type in the chat. And give permission to StreamYard, like it says on the screen, so we can see your comments and I can give you the points for, for you know, following along and being chatty. All right. So um, I am going to bring my friend and sister uh, sales director, Marsha Amaral, on screen and let her talk to you about, like, the start of your routine, what you're going to do. Um, so let me add her right now. Hey, Marsha. Hey. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. This is so exciting. Uh, it's my first time on YouTube as well, so this is going to be really fun. So I get to talk to you about uh, the start of your skincare routine. And 
when you've got your makeup on, like, you know, after the show, this is what I'm going to be doing, um, you want to take off your eye makeup. Always, always, always take off your eye makeup before you go to bed. Don't leave it on. That's really bad for your eyes, uh, for your tissues around your eyes and that. So it's really not that good for you. So I always start off with our oil-free eye makeup remover. It is one of my favorites. You just shake it up because it's got two layers. One that will take off waterproof mascara or liner and the other one that will take non-waterproof mas uh, mascara and eyeshadows off. And so it's great. What I love about it, I'm a contact wearer and it doesn't uh, burn my eyes, doesn't irritate my eyes. Um, it doesn't leave a film on my eyes like some before Mary Kay that I had tried. Uh, so, you know, with contacts, I can just, if I want to change my look at night, you know, I'm going out, I can do that. So it's our oil-free eye makeup remover, which is great. And then to take off my foundation so that my cleanser can do what it's supposed to do, we have our Meissler water, which is awesome. It is just amazing. Put a little bit on a cotton pad and just take it all off. It's so refreshing. You can use it as like a, a, a mini cleanse as, uh, when you're coming from the gym and you just want to freshen up before you get home or whatever. You can use this. It is awesome. It, it just takes off your foundation nice and gentle, and you don't have to rinse it off. You can just leave it on, and then you can go to your cleanser. So these are two that are really great, and uh, they pair up nicely. Right now we have a special on the Meister water. If you buy two, then you get, and I happen to have some right here, this bag of cotton fabric uh, wipes that you put it on and take it off. It has, a, it has about five of them in here, and then you put it in a little mesh bag and throw it in the laundry, and it washes them all. They're, uh, so they're not just disposable ones. These are ones you can keep using in this cute little bag. So just ask your consultant about that. So these are great. And they're, um, I believe they're 18 each. I believe they're 18 each. Um, so but check your pricing. We just had a price change. And so I'm kind of still getting used to the, the new prices. Okay, so now you have your foundation off and you have your eye makeup off. Now it's time to use your cleanser. And we have lots of choices depending on where you are in your life and this and that. So we have the first one that I have is our TimeWise 3D cleanser. And it comes in two formulas, one for normal to dry, one for combination to oily. The one for combination oily is more like a gel. The normal to dry is a creamier version. And it's a four in one cleanser. Now, what does that do? That means it cleanses, it gently exfoliates, but it's safe to use twice a day. Uh, and I just leave it in the shower because I use it morning and night. And then um, it has a freshener toner in it. And it also has vitamin B3. And vitamin B3 is a brightener. So it brightens your skin. So these are great. And anti, you know, it's got all of our anti-aging products in it. It also has resveratrol in it which is great to protect your skin and help to counteract the signs of aging. And so this, these are great. In fact, the, the whole set of our TimeWise um, 3D skincare, have, they all four steps has the res resveratrol in it. And so it's always, you know, 24 hours a day, it's uh, helping fight that anti-aging, okay? So that's one. Then we have if you need to, want our Cadillac cleanser. So this is our uh, repair cleanser and it's a foaming cleanser. And this is, you know, I mean, you can use it even if you don't have advanced signs of aging, but this is awesome because it just gives you that luxurious feel like you're really pampering yourself at a spa, somebody just washing your face with the cleanser. It is amazing and it's great with our uh, cleansing brush as well. So this is, uh, this is great for all skin types not just normal to dry or combination oily, it's just like for all skin types. This is our, this is our repair one. And then we have, you know, some people like the natural. Okay, so we have our natural cleanser. And um, this one actually, we have four steps in the natural line, but uh, the cleanser is, uh, what was it, 90, 99.48 percent natural they had to put something in it to hold it together but it's very great it's awesome it you know if you have really so super sensitive skin it's great for that or if uh, you just like a natural line you're more into that this is awesome this is our natural cleanser and you just you know squeeze out a little bit a dot is a lot on all of our products so just 
be sparing with it because uh, it just it will last you quite a while but you see how big this tube is all right and then we have okay oh and i do want to say one thing about our um another one too before i get into the next two this is one that you don't really hear a whole lot about but we have people that just love it this is our cleansing bar our time wise cleansing bar and it comes in this cute little case and it has little specks in there actually those are uh, microbeads uh, microbeads to help with the gentle exfoliation and then also microbeads to help freshen her tone and you can actually use this cleanser to clean your makeup brushes it does a great job so it's a multi-task <laughs> and you can leave it in the shower you know men like it as well if they want like a bar or so um and it is great this is really it's been a, a long time and they changed uh, the packaging when we change packaging but it is great it's always a, a top favorite with a lot of people so this is our our uh, cleansing bar then we have okay if you have you know, if you say you have, you're not really worried about anti-aging, <laughs> we have our botanical line. And the botanical line has a great gel cleanser. I have a cousin that just loves anything gel. And this is great. It's also great to help with, um, you know, younger ladies, you know, little pre-teens and teens to get them to learn how to take care of their skin because it's very gentle. And this is great. So it's the botanical cleanser has lots of, um, you know different botanicals in it so it's not going to be irritating it's just very cooling and soothing and this is an awesome one and then there's also the toner so you can after you cleanse your face and rinsed it off then you can use this with a cotton pad to put a, a toner on your on your face and so that helps to get off any excess of the cleanser all right now our time wise actually has toner in it um the Repair does not, but that's okay because we have other things for them repair, <laughs> but which we'll tell you about later. Anyway, and then we have for people that maybe are acne prone. For acne prone skin, we have our uh, purifying gel, uh, cleansing gel. Now this is great because it really helps to clean out the pores. Uh, it helps with, uh, you know, to keep those clean. This is great for teenagers. Maybe they're going through that time or even some adults that get adult acne, then this is great for that too. Um, and so it has a 2% salicylic acid. And so you want to be, you know, just mindful. You don't want to have anything around your eyes for any of the cleansers because you want to make sure that, you know, you're just very gentle around the eye area. And so this is great for uh, any time. I know when I first started, we had um, a similar cleanser with it in Mary Kay and that my daughter, my youngest daughter was going through through that where she was starting to break out. And so this really helped her better than <laughs> the dermatologist. And then we also have the, um, the uh, the toner, which is the blemish control toner, and it also has 2% salicylic acid. Now this one, you don't really want to be, be put it all over your face like you could with the botanical, uh, because you really want to concentrate on maybe the areas where you're broken out. Uh, and they and they say to put it on maybe one to three times a day, but when you're first starting out, just do it maybe once a day, because it does dry out the area and typically more oily skin tends to get more breakouts than more drier skin so this is great for that but you don't want to dry it out too much so you want to start off and then maybe build up to that if you're really getting a lot of breakouts so this is our, our clear proof um, uh, toner and then it has of course the the cleanser okay so we've pre-cleansed our skin taken off our eye makeup pre-cleansed our skin use our cleanser now it's time to exfoliate and get rid of all that dead skin that you know because our body naturally naturally exfoliates about every 28 days but you know you get those little dead skin cells on your face and it just dulls your complexion so you really want to make sure that you use a, an exfoliator you know a couple of times a week depending on your skin type so you know normal to dry maybe once a week they'll do you a uh, combination twice a week if you're really oily super oily you could do it like three times a week but not you know right in a row you want to skip a day to let your skin uh, rejuvenate okay so i get to talk to you also about our exfoliators so one of my fa in fact they're all my favorites who am i kidding um but our microdermabrasion refined step now this step is aluminum oxide crystals and it is the same uh, product that you would have 
if you went to a spa and did a microderm treatment. Okay, and so I just leave this one in the shower right along with my cleanser. So on the days that I do it, I put my cleanser on the shower, rinse it off, then I put this on in the shower, rinse it off, and oh my gosh, the water just sheets off your face. It just leaves your skin so soft and smooth. And this is our microdermabrasion. This is great just for topical skincare. Those dead skin cells are there because if you don't exfoliate, you're just cleaning dead skin cells. And so you really want to, you know, show that bright face that you have. All right. Then we have for, if you want a little bit extra, like maybe go down a couple of layers, this is our, um, this is our replenish or revealing, <laughs> I guess I always forget that. Revealing Radiance Peel. Now, nothing in Mary Kay peels off. So it's very gentle because it has a lot of um, botanicals in there to help you not have any irritation. And so you would put it on kind of like you would a mask, leave it on for 10 minutes. After you wash your face, you would put this on, just smooth it on. It's very, I'll show you, it's very uh, clear. Actually kind of creamy. There you go, creamy. And so it, but it does go, um, blend out very very lightly so you don't see it on your face. It's not going to show up like maybe some of our other masks will. But this is great. So it's a it just goes down to this uh, another couple of layers to help get rid of any of those dead skin cells that are trying to hold on to those uh, new skin cells and it lets the skin new skin cells rise up to the surface. So this is great. This is our radiance peel. Okay. So this is another one to exfoliate. And then we also have, again, for the natural line, we have our natural um, exfoliating powder. Now, this is great because you can actually use this to whatever roughage, I don't want to know how, how you would say it, how, how much you want to, to be like, like an abrasive exfoliator, or do you want it to be just more natural or lighter? So you can actually, if you mix it with water, it's going to be more of like a feel of a microderm treatment. Uh, but you can actually blend it with um, the cleanser so that you can blend it with a natural cleanser and just, uh, you know, screw a little bit of the cleanser in, put a little bit of the exfoliating powder in there, mix it together, put it on your face, and then just rinse it off. You don't need to leave it on. And then you, you can also blend it with our um, natural nourishing oil as well. And that's great too. That's a little bit softer, but it, it, it works you know, all three ways. So the choice is yours is how you would like it. It's gonna, <clears throat> excuse me, it's gonna feel a little bit stronger if you do it, if you just mix it with water, okay? And then last but not least, we have our botanical, uh, let's see, is it called the invigorating scrub? Yes, so it is an invigorating scrub. And it does, I'm saying, I'm gonna put a little bit on here. It is still the gel, so you can see the gel. Okay, and so it does, do gently a scrub you can feel the little beads in there and that's fine and it does a great job on this uh, like I said it's great for I like it for like the younger ladies you know like like I said the preteens to get them used to taking care of their skin um, or if they have very sensitive skin it's great for that as well um, I probably would use this with a preteen uh, as opposed to maybe the, the powder or the other two because the, their skin is still very, very sensitive. So you want to pre-cleanse, then cleanse, and then do your mask when it's your, your time to do your mask. And so I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know which ones you like the best or you want to hear more about it. At, you, know, you can talk to your consultant or her director about that. And it's back to you, Alice. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm bringing us all on for a second just to thank you, Marcia, for all that great information. And um, I, I love how there's all those products, but they can use them at different times. But that's the order you would want to take off your makeup, like she said, and then cleanse and then exfoliate. So whichever one of those products or multiple that you're using, that's the order so far. So we're all on the same page, right? All right. So um, Gina, do you want to tell the consultants, um, do you want to show the card that we're working for, working from and let them know their, their guests need to comment in the chat um, so that we know who has the most guests on um, because, you know, listen to this amazing information. 
Kind of. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, so I'm just going to do an old school, right? Um, so we have these amazing cards. It's called the Order of Application. You can see it right here. Your consultant can share the file. And uh, just a little hectic day, so I didn't have the file ready to go. But it's a two-sided, and it talks order of application, and that's the exact order that we're presenting it in this evening. So number one, you remove your makeup, starting with the oil-free eye makeup remover, like likely Marsha did at the beginning. Then uh, she just finished talking about the cleansers and the toners, right? Step number two right? Cleanse and tone. And then she also talked about exfoliation, step number three. And we have different ways to exfoliate, mechanical or chemical. And then um, next we're going to go into the mask, boosters, moisturizers. And the last thing is to protect your lips and your peeps, your peeper keepers, protect your eyes and protect your lips. So your consultant can get this to you. And if your consultant doesn't know, she'll get to one of us directors and we can make it available to you. Just so helpful, especially if you're using the full pink collection to remember what goes first. So we're hoping that by walking you through and talking about all the different products that we have, all the different choices that you have, that you will truly find your customized approach to your skincare needs. So is the Mary Kay order of application chart. The other little cool thing that you guys, I discovered long after, do you see the little moon and the stars right here in each area? That's to remind you daytime for sun and the moon, you do it at night, right? So if you don't like, like to read, you just need to read, remove makeup, cleanse and tone morning and night, and make sure you do all seven steps. That's what I want to say. All right, I wanted to unmute so I could come back. All right, so I'm gonna continue on with order of application. So I'm gonna send our girls backstage. All right, and I'm gonna take it away. After exfoliation, that's when you're gonna wanna use your serums and your um, hair and your boosters, okay? So I have my little notes here. Um, oh, I'm sorry, I skipped. I skipped. Okay, so exfoliate, then mask. So Marsha talked about um, our exfoliations, which are more going to remove the top layer of the skin. I'm going to show you some masks that do something different. So my first mask here is our TimeWise Lifting Biocellulose Mask. Now, who doesn't want to look 10 years younger, right? Right here. Um, so this product, let's say you have a special event to go to. I mean, I don't wait for a special event. I just kind of do it all year long. But if you have a special event to go to, you um, purchase this from your consultant. You're going to get four of these sheet masks, okay? And they're really kind of fun. Um, they're sealed, and there's a ton of product in here. You can, like, feel the liquid in here. And when you get ready to use this, after you've washed, after you've exfoliated and toned and cleansed and all that stuff, now you could do this. So you would cut open this at the top here, pull the mask out, and you're going to attach it to your face and you're going to look crazy. In fact, my family looked at me like, what is that? The first time I did it, but now they're used to seeing it. Um, it is very cooling. So I personally love it during hot weather, but I learned a trick recently from my senior director. She puts this little, she kind of folds it like that and puts it in a warm cup of water to warm it up. So in a, on a cold evening, if you don't want it to be cold, you can go ahead and, um, and warm it up in a cup of warm water. However, if you're having a personal summer, this feels really amazing. Okay. So just apply that to your face and you're just going to sit back and relax. And there are little flaps on your eyes. So sometimes I want it for my eyes, but if I'm just watching TV and relaxing and I want to take the little flaps off, you can put those in other places. So like my nose is 
bigger because I'm, you know, Italian and Portuguese. So, um, so sometimes I put the little flaps, I rip them off and I put them right here so that my whole nose gets covered. Right. Or sometimes I'm putting it down here because the mask goes to like about here. And so sometimes I'll put it like on my neck. So you can decide whatever you want to do with the little eye flaps, but this mask, there's four in here. And the idea is that you'll do two one week and two the next week. And in a two week period, you'll take yourself back in time 10 years. Um, it'll lift, tighten, firm. Okay. So it does all of this that you want, right? So it's kind of like your, um, your facelift without any pain or needles, right? <laughs> um, so that's one mask that we have. And then the next mask I'm going to share is my absolute favorite. This is our clear proof deep cleansing charcoal mask. Um, this is the full size tube. It lasts quite a long time. I've never actually counted how many times I've used it before tubes run out, but I feel like it lasts so long. Um, it's suitable for all skin, skin types and skin tones. Um, what it does is it's so the charcoal, the activated charcoal in here works like a magnet and it's going to pull out 10 times its weight in junk that's stuck in your pores. So if you haven't been cleansing your skin properly, or you maybe haven't been using the right products for your face and stuff has kind of gotten packed into your pores, this is going to clean it all out, right? When the pores are clear, they can close up. So then they will appear smaller. So you really want that. The other thing is it's got rosemary and peppermint. These are all things to take down inflammation. Um, so it smells amazing, right? It's minty. It's refreshing. It is a clay mask. So it's going to kind of harden on your face and tighten. And then you'll see these little dots appear. And mine usually appear like around my nose, a little bit on my forehead and kind of in the jawline. That's my T-zone. It does tend to be oilier. And so those are the pores that it's really doing a lot of work. But I've, you know, had it work in other areas. You even can use charcoal mask in your armpits right? All our lymph nodes are in there and it's sometimes good to detox that area. So you can use that there. You can use it on the bottoms of your feet, all your nerve endings end in your feet. So detoxing your feet, cause it's going to pull everything out of the pores wherever you put it. So just make sure you put it on and you, you know, sit back and relax for a good 20 minutes. I like to leave it on for 30. Um, and then you take it off. Now, the other thing that makes ours unique and special is it doesn't pull off. So, you know, you see these charcoal masks that are painful when they pull off. This one, I just get a warm towel and, um, you know, secure it to wherever I've put the product. So if it's here or on my face or on my feet, you know, just kind of put the heat on it and then it will steam and loosen the product. And then you just wipe away. It's so easy. And um, all of those like any kind of blackheads, any of that stuff all come out. And if you have a pimple starting, that's the time to use this. Friends, this product makes the pimple go away overnight. Um, so no more of that like toothpaste trick. <laughs> um, it works better than any medication uh, a dermatologist ever gave me. It's not painful. It smells good and there's no side effects. So I was sold right away. Um and then another mask that you can use after you've exfoliated. And this one is amazing because you can sleep in it. This is our moisture renewing gel mask. Okay. So this one, you can put it on with your charcoal. Let's say you have drier skin. Maybe you have so dry a skin that it's kind of peely in this area, but your T-zone is oily. You can actually do what's called multi-masking. You can put your charcoal mask on the T-zone and you can put this moisture, this moisture mask. Um, on the drier areas. What I like to do is put my charcoal mask everywhere and get all my pores cleared out. And then I like to um, finish with my moisture gel mask because you can actually go to bed. This is the one mask you can sleep in. So this does no exfoliation. This just is hydrating. So this is a pampering mask. This is going to, your skin's just going to absorb it in. So you can put it on like a traditional mask and wash it off 20 minutes later. Um, well, it says 10 minutes later, or you can leave it on all night if you want. And your skin will take all that goodness. And then when you wake up in the morning, you can wash it off. So these are three masks that you would do after the exfoliation that Marsha talked about. Okay. Now I'm going to get into boosters and serums. So we have two new boosters. I'm absolutely loving them. 
And because we have so many serums, you might be using multiple, right? You might be using, um, you might be wanting to use our new boosters, but you might already be using our tone corrector or vitamin C plus E. So I want to point out what the differences are. And then I'm going to tell you how I decide what to put on first. So first of all, this is part of our clinical solutions, derma cosmetic line. Okay. So what this is um, that Mary Kay spent a lot of time and um, tons of research on making these products. They are um, vitamin C plus resveratrol line reducer. So who's worried about lines and wrinkles? That one's for you. It's going to make, um, it's going to get rid of lines and wrinkles and it's going to um, really actively boost your skincare. So you must, if you're worried about lines and wrinkles, you're probably using an anti-aging already, right? And this is just going to boost up the product. Okay. And then this one is HA plus ceramide hydrator. And what that means is, um, first of all, they're dermatologist tested. Maybe I should read the English, right? Uh, uh, it's funny. I never noticed this before. Dermatologist tested, not, okay, so in all of our products, if it hasn't already been said, they're non-comedogenic. What that means is it will not clog your pores. Okay, so I was super concerned about that when I started with Mary Kay. I was very sensitive skin. Everything broke me out. All these products, non-comedogenic, will not clog your pores, all right? So um, this one contains hyaluronic acid, ceramides, and verbena extract to help the skin retain moisture and support the skin barrier. So what it does is it helps to repair the skin barrier. You can use both boosters together. I do. I love them. Um, and when you do, you want to think of the alphabet, right? C comes before the letter H, right? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. So you're going to put on your C plus, oops, long one in front of the camera. C plus Reservatrol line reducer first. And then you're going to put on your HA ceramide hydrator. Okay, so you can use them one right after the next. The way I decide what serum or booster is going to go first is the one that I'm most concerned with or the one that I feel my skin needs the most. So because these are part of our Derma Cosmetic line, I feel like they're a little stronger. So I'm going to put them right on my skin. So I'm going to do the C plus Reservatrol first. And then I'm going to use the HA plus Ceramide second. Okay. Then um, I do love our C plus E. I do currently use this product. Sorry, I'm trying to find the front for you. And the light is making it so fun. You too can do this on YouTube. <laughs> so C plus E, um, this is a serum that I would then, you know, put it, go ahead and put it on next. Um, this one is for dry to oily skin. So again, all skin types, this one's going to help, um, with evening any kind of spots or discoloration, brightening the skin, um, giving a more youthful glow again, non-comedogenic, all the products are, um, it just says smooth product evenly over face in upward and outward motion. Okay. So I like to apply my um, serums with the massager from our um, Skin Vigorate brush. So I just will put, put the serum on and then I'll just give myself a little facial massage. So a lot of these I like to do at night uh, because that's when I have a lot more time. I'm not rushing around trying to get my son to school. Um, and then I'll rotate so that I, I want my skin to get benefits. So I don't necessarily want to pile them all on top of each other, but you can put all your boosters on together. So, um, if you did microdermabrasion, pore minimizer comes with the microdermabrasion refine. And what this does is it calms and soothes the redness in the skin. So this is a great product to use. I use it whenever I do microdermabrasion, but you could use it if you have larger pores and you want them to appear smaller, or if you, um, you know, just need to soothe. Maybe you have an irritation. One time I got a spider bite and it was pretty inflamed. And um, if you've ever had a spider bite, you know what I'm talking about. I put a little bit of this on and it soothed that redness and brought the swelling down. So there's products, I mean, uh, ingredients in here that are going to take down inflammation and calm the skin. So if you, if you get red easily, like maybe from using the glycolic peel or from over exfoliation, maybe like you were a little rough because you were trying to get some dead skin off. This is a great um, serum to calm the skin and get rid of that redness. So I love our pore minimizer for that reason. Um, another one, this one, my husband uses regularly. This is our tone corrector. So if you have, um, 
if you have different discoloration in your skin or you feel like it's uneven, tone corrector is amazing for that, right? It will take that, um, whatever the dark spots, sometimes it's like age spots or like I felt because when I was younger, I never wore SPF on my face. I had a lot of freckles come out once I became an adult. And so this softens all of that. And, it, and I mean, I have pretty smooth, clear skin. I still have some freckles, but I think the ones I have left are cute <laughs> um, and not so much an issue. Right. And then our um, advanced lifting serum. Now this is part of our repair line. And I always tell my customers that use this here, this has one of the uh, trackers to tell you how fast you're using it up to. I love that. This product, I like to use it all in here, right? I want to lift. I don't, my forehead doesn't need too much lift usually. So I focus the use of this product down in here. Um, and if you're, if you notice, like if you're losing any kind of weight and there's like a little bit of, uh, maybe sag to your skin because, you know, um, gravity is always working against us, right? So if you're noticing some of that, this is a great product to use to tighten and firm and give yourself just a little lift here. This and then that first mask that I talked about, the sheet mask. They're both from our repair line. So they are the most advanced um, anti-aging. And um, when you're using the sheet mask, I meant to mention this. Remember I said there was a lot of product in that envelope. One of my consultants discovered that if she just closed it up and clipped it, she could put on product for maybe three nights after using the mask. So when you get to the part of where you're using the serums and stuff in your evening routine, she just had it on her nightstand, opened it up, dipped her fingers in and rubbed it on her face and closed it and left it there. And it and the product in the little pouch lasted her three nights after the night she did the mask. So her, she had... Um, people that she saw daily noticing the changes in her skin. So after she told me that, I started doing that. And I meant to pass that along to you. <laughs> um, let's see. I have two more products. This one, as you can tell, I use it a lot. This is my deep wrinkle filler. And you get a lot of product in here. And um, Mary Kay's, you know, the, the dot is a lot. That statement is for real. But um, I'll, I'll make sure I get it all out before I open a new one. So when, when you squeeze some of this out, you're just going to fill in the line. So I like to use this during the day because it gives me instant results. So it is going to soften any kind of line. So I have this like one little expression line right here. And I'll like fill it in under my foundation and it softens the line there. So most of you can't even see it unless I make the face, right? Um <laughs> And, uh, and I'll also get like a little smile line right here. So this will soften any kind of lines from the expressions you make. And then um, it does have ingredients in it to work to get rid of the line over time. So this gives you instant gratification. If you're like, I need the line gone now, this will fill it in a little bit goes a long way. You don't want to put too much just like, and you're, you're going to do the stippling motion. So you put it on and you just kind of dab it in the area and then it will go in your skin underneath your moisturizer. So it will do its job for the day. But in the meantime, it's working long term so that you don't have to continue. And my last little serum slash, I don't know what you, what else you, gel treatment <laughs> is our clear proof acne treatment gel. And this is great for teens. You know, basically I, I would it's better than, but like when I was a teenager, I was using like the little zinc tube or whatever that I would get, um, or Noxema, I would get it at Walgreens. This is higher quality. You'll use less of it. And it actually helps provide like when, if you have an acne issue and you put it in that area and you know that, um, benzoyl peroxide is what takes care of it for you. You can over time, apply it to the area that you would have the breakout. And over time, it helps um, develop like a, an antibacterial layer so that you don't get the pimple there, right? So if, if um, benzoyl peroxide is your jam and that's what works with your acne, because we have salicylic acid and benzoyl peroxide, the two things both work on acne. Some people need both. Some people need one or the other. Um, so if you know this is it, this will perform this, you know, just over time, let's say I'm always getting pimples here and I put just a little bit there over time, there will be a layer of like antibacterial and it won't get the pimple 
right? So this really gets rid of that and clears up skin for teens um, specifically, but adult acne is a thing. Like I still get acne to this day and I love our um, clear proof line because it helps keep my face looking like this. So um, many of you have seen me uh, with a random pimple or two, and then I'll use our clear proof line and you'll see me the next time and it's gone. So I'm going to um, bring up our next speaker and she's going to continue with order of application. And um, that is Gina. Wow, wow, wow. I am learning so much. And we are so lucky to have something for everyone, right? And so now we started off with our first step is remove all your makeup. Cleansing is the name of the game. Then cleansing and toning. And again, we have a product for whatever your skin desires, even products for men, right? And then the next step, exfoliation, because you could be doing all of that, but if you're not sloughing off those dead skin cells, well, then the product can't really do its thing, right? So that's really important to exfoliate, as Marsha shared. And then, of course, the pampering part. That's what I call it. When you have a choice to put on your mask, if you want to look 20 years younger, well, then you're going to want that sheet mask that Alice just talked about. If you want to wake up feeling hydrated and relaxed, then you're going to use that gel mask. And then for that, ooh, open up my pores, make me feel like I just came back from the spa, then you're going to want your charcoal mask. And then the boosters and serums, that's exactly what they are to boost all those other things that you have been using. So now we're going to go into the next step, which is to hydrate and protect your skin. And let me tell you why it's important. Even for me, I have combination oily skin. The older I get, the more combination it is. But when I was younger, I was definitely shine on all the time, really oily. So I thought, I don't want to put any moisturizer on because my skin is really oily already, right? Wrong. Whether you have dry, oily, or combination skin, moisturizing is really an important and excellent step to incorporate into your daily routine because what happens is your moisturizer actually helps keep your skin hydrated and refreshed. And as we age, the oil glands that keep skin healthy, they kind of begin to lose their power, making it to where they create fewer oils. And then so moisturizing is daily, is a daily cause um, so that your glands have not to work so hard and to keep your skin, this is what we want, looking healthy and young, right? Throughout your life, no matter what number that birth certificate says. So why does moisturizing important? Number one, it decreases skin issues. It decreases skin issues. Your skin dries out and so many issues pop up, no pun intended, when your skin is dry and is due to an imbalance that occurs. You have a clogged pore or just an increased balance, redness, you know, irritation. Those are all things telling you that your skin needs more hydration. The other reason why you want to moisturize is, okay, who's with me on this one? Looking and feeling younger. Raise your hand, right? Certain areas of our skin tend to replace the cells more quickly, more frequently than the rest of our skin. So guess what those areas are? Your ears, your neck, your chest, and the rest of your face. And so you want to look young and fresh, right? Uh, so that's why you want to hydrate. Using the right moisturizer is going to help keep your skin looking young, right? And then, okay, the obvious answer, moisturizer helps fight wrinkles. We don't want those, right? We don't want chicken feet, crow feet, no kind of feet, right? No wrinkles. And so no one wants to look older before the time. So that's why it's important by adding a moisturizer into your daily routine, it really can help keep those wrinkles at a minimum because your skin plumps up when you add a moisturizer, giving your face a firmer appearance and showing up fewer wrinkles. So the bonus is moisturizers can keep your skin looking young and um, keeping your pores nice and smooth. So you need to incorporate a moisturizer and I have a few to offer you. The other thing that I'm gonna be talking about is 
protecting your skin. We work so hard to cleanse and exfoliate and mask and hydrate. So now we want to form a barrier and want to protect our skin. And so you should always, always, always wear sunscreen, even on the cloudy days, because when that's happening, still 80%, they say, of the sun, sun's rays are coming in through the clouds, through your window, through your curtains, and they're making damage on our skin. So sunscreen is very important, not only for keeping our skin looking young, but it's actually a healthcare rabbit. Let me tell you, healthcare habit. Five reasons why you want to have protection. It protects your skin from the UVA rays, right? It lowers your skin cancer risk. Cancer is on the rise, right? And so we want to stop that. It prevents premature skin aging and it helps maintain an even skin tone. Um, and then of course, minimizes your risk of skin cancer. All right, so that's why this step, moisturizing and protecting is so very important. And we have quite a few, oh my gosh. So I'm gonna start off with our TimeWise 3D products. Um, we have a line with SPF 30 and one without for those that might have a sensitivity to the product that is actually in sunscreen. But really, you want to moisturize with the 3D. We have the day cream, right? And I love the beautiful pink color. And we have one for oily skin, which is the purple. And then we have one for normal to combination skin. You want to use this after you use your cleansing, after your, after your boosters, you want to hydrate. And I already gave you some hopefully some good reasons why you don't want to skip this step. What I love about 3D is, first of all, the smell, and it's all derived from the natural ingredients in the product. And as you've seen my other teachers share, a little dot will do you. So it's about this much, and you're going to put that moisturizer all over your face, as Alice said, always working upward and outward. Don't help gravity out, right? And so you have your day cream in the 3D, and you also have your night cream, which is this kind of gray tube. And I'm showing you the um, one for combination oily skin. So this is your day cream protection. This is your night cream. And so this is like taking vitamins at night to work best when your body is at rest. It's going to observe and work together with the day cream. So you're going to have 24 hour hydration going on and protection in the 3D uh, um, uh, system, right? So that's that. Okay. So next, we want to talk about the repair. And this is what I use personally because, you know, I'm a little bit over 25, right? So I want to turn back the hands of time. And this is for advanced signs of aging. It's not for younger, older people. It's for advanced signs of aging when you want to turn back the time um, on your skin. And so, again, we have a day product, which you're going to use at daytime. And then we have our night cream right? With retinol. And you probably heard retinol mentioned a few times. It's good. It helps do all of this. And so what I love about our repair is, first of all, the application is so simple. You, there's a place right here where your fingers fit perfectly. One pump will do it. It uh, pushes out just the right amount of product. This is the day cream. You're going to take it and you're going to put it all over your face um, after your um, cleansing and after your boosters to protect you, right? We already talked about why you need the SPF. And this one has SPF 30, which nowadays is for incidental sun exposure. All right. So day cream to protect you every day, but also in these, there is the hydration step. There's no separate moisturizer in our skincare line, except for a couple that I'm going to talk about. But in these two systems, the 3D and the repair, the hydration is in the day creams themselves. And, um, and then, of course, at night, you're going to wash, uh, boost, put your serum on, and then you're going to put on your night cream, which is, is encapsulated because it has um, retinol. And retinol breaks down when it's exposed to the light. So this is why it's in this double barrier seal. It's darker. And this is why you also are going to put it on at night because it makes your uh, skin sensitive to sun. So you're putting on at night. But then the next morning, you're going to go ahead and put on your day cream to protect it. And this too has that very easy way. So you know you're getting the right formula by pumping, and then you just go ahead and apply that. Oh, and by the way, you may have heard this mentioned, whatever you're doing all over here, you also want to remove, remember your neck area, your decollete area, and my little free tip, also your driving arm, whatever you're doing to protect you and keep that younger because it's always exposed to the sun. All right, so that's the repair hydrating and protection.
Next, I want to talk about our clear proof line. It was mentioned before, uh, and every system has its cleanser, moisturizer, mask, right? So you have a complete system. So this is our clear proof, right? And this is the oil free moisturizer for acne prone skin. And my sister, Marsha, um, who's been in business with me for about 25 plus years, we had a classic line before and I, a customer was asking for that classic moisturizer. And my sister, Marsha, school is never out for the pro set. This is what took, took the place of that particular moisturizer. It's designed for acne prone skin, but it's actually works well if you have really combination and oily prone skin. You put it on, wear it all day, and it's just very light, lightweight, and absorbs quickly. And the best part, why my customer is looking for the other one, is it helps control the shine. It gives you a really nice finish, but it's also providing some hydration up to 12 hours a day. Okay, now moving into the botanical line. Um, oh, I love these. Okay, you have your choice. We have the naturally moisturizing stick, right? Which is just what it sounds like. It comes in a little stick like this, right? And this one is brand new. So you can roll it up and apply it wherever you want, including your lips, right? It's a spot application um, moisturizer. And as mentioned earlier, this is a natural product. So it's 100%. Ooh, I'm being recorded, but it's natural. It's a natural derivative, safe for sensitive skin, dermatologist tested. And you just smooth it all, all over face or body, wherever you're feeling that you need that extra hydration, but you don't want to deal with the chemicals. Even the packaging is beautiful. All right. My other option, and this is my go-to for everything, even though I have um, oily skin, this is the naturally nourishing oil. This is a beautiful dry oil with almond. It smells amazing. And it's a dry oil. So what does that mean? It's going to hydrate, give you a nice shimmer and shine but it's not going to be heavy and greasy as you think an oil would be. And so what I love with this is that you just apply two or three drops. It has its own dropper, two or three drops. And I just pamper myself. I love the smell, but you know what? You see all these curls. Oh my gosh. It is so great for keeping that frizz down without weighing down my curls. I just love what this does for my hair and it smells amazing. Also, I learned that if you burn yourself, you could take a couple of drops and put it on the bite or cut or burn, and it totally soothes and helps heal it. Naturally nourishing oil. I love it. I, I think they need to make the bottle bigger, all right, because I love it. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and talk a little bit more about uh, our men's line. Yes, I told you we have something for everyone. And, you know, men's skin is thicker, so they need something that is richer to provide the right amount of hydration for them and protection. And so the two products that I'm going to talk about, first of all, is we have the Advanced, the Mary Kay Men Advanced Facial Hydrator with sunscreen of SPF 30, right? This is an everyday hydrator, but it's richer because again, men's skin is a few layers thicker than women, plus they shave. So they really need that extra hydration. And it's also going to help prevent sunburn because it has the SPF. And however, warning, if your guy shaves, you don't want to put this on on broken or irritated skin. You want to maybe calm it down with our nourishing oil, our naturally moisturizing stick, or you can just go over to the advanced facial hydrator, which is again, specifically for dry to oily skin, and it's going to help prevent sunburn and give you protection and decrease the risk of cancer. That's what that protection is all about. Use it daily, apply it 15 minutes before you go on to sun exposure to make sure that you're taking advantage of the full benefit. The other product is the after, that Mary Kay Men Cooling After Shave Gel. Okay, it says men, but you know what? I use it on my legs too because it just feels so great and it just really soothes and calms 
your skin after shaving or using a razor just really calms and soothes and hydrating leaves your skin so soft and hydrated. I like to use it on my legs after shaving, or if you still raise, use a razor to shave your underarms, this is also fabulous for that. You know, um, we just share products here, family products, right? Uh, because it doesn't say it's for men and women, it's for skin and whatever you need. So these are really great. When my son started shaving, he just really fell in love with these. Plus he can just walk down the hall to get them from my closet. All right. All right. Just a couple more products to go here with the moisturizer and protect before we go into the peepers and the keepers. Um, these are two favorite and I think really like not talked about enough. And besides, look at this beautiful packaging. Look at this. It just looks beautiful. And this this first one is our intense moisturizer, moisturizing cream. And it's a gel. Beautiful. Whoops. Sorry. I got the wrong one. Here we go. It's just beautiful, and you want to never put your finger in the jar. You want to use a spatula, which is somewhere here, to remove the product. You don't want to contaminate the jar by putting your finger directly in here. So we have the Intense Moisturizing Cream and the Oil-Free Hydrating Gel. Okay, simple definition, a tall drink of water for your skin whenever you want. Even if you have your makeup on already and you're feeling like, oh, my skin feels a little thirsty, you can just grab a little bit with your spatula and just press it under your skin and immediately oh, you're going to feel that hydration working. And what does that mean? You know why it's also important to hydrate your skin? Your makeup is going to look so much better and it's going to wear so much longer when your skin is properly cleansed, exfoliated, and hydrated. All right. So these are, you could use at night, but really you can use it anytime during the day. When I go skiing, I put this on because that chill weather kind of burns and irritates your skin. So this gives you a protection um, layer. Plus it's also hydrating at the same time. And then let's see. Oh, I forgot one. Moisturizing gel. The moisturizing gel. We have so many options, okay? And this is for your teens, right? And it's just a gentle moisturizing gel, oil-free, fragrance-free, non-comedogenic, which means it won't clog your pores. It's good for sensitive skin. And this is just really, you're going to apply it all over your face. And remember, this is part of your face using upward strokes. Um, and it's a gel, so you can see. It's really pretty clear. And also has kind of a nice texture. I love it. Anything gel just it feels like it's just going right into your skin. Okay. And never waste it. I'm putting it on my hands, right? Moisturizing the top of my hands. All right. So I think this is my last one talking about um, hydration. Oh my gosh. This goes, this is the original formula. This is Mary Kay Extra Omoniant Night Cream. Yes. The pink stuff right? The pink stuff never changed the formula. Still a top selling product. It's super rich. Petroleum based is pink. It has this unique smell to it. Fragrance free. This is before we knew that fragrance was not necessarily good for your skin, but this is so still very popular. This is for very dry skin. You're going to apply a small amount to clean skin and for added hydration, you can dampen your skin first with water prior to applying to get that really ah, spa effect. This one is also good for cuts and burns, for healing the skin, because it just makes such a rich barrier and such a rich hydration. And so the original formula is still popular. I love to put it on my, I mean, you know, Today was really nice out here. So it's like spring is here or summer is here. So I didn't quite get to get a pedicure. So this is going to soften my heels, you know, and it's also going to give a nice shine and hydrate and soften my skin, soften my skin. So the extra emollient night cream, it's great. It's great to pamper yourself with. So that's, so I think that's everything. Yep. So that's our moisturizing and protection product line your step number six in your skincare system. All right. So the last set of products is going to be your eye care and your lip care, your peepers. You want to keep these guys really youthful and happy and lifted. And of course this, you know, that's everything. So I'm going to start with my new favorite, well, actually that sheet mask that Alice was talking about is my favorite, but this is my next favorite. And to tell you what I do, 
I put these on first, my petals from my face, and then I put on my sheet mask for some really extra pampering. That's right. Why not, right? And so what I love about our hydrogel eye patches is that, oh, they're so hydrating and just so beautiful too. Look at that, right? And uh, I call them petals for my eyes. It has its own little applicator to lift it. And I like to put one here, one here, one here, and one here, right? Because if they're hydrating and lifted, I want it. And you put this on, you could sleep with these as well. I've been known to fall asleep with them. And uh, they just really help smooth, hydrate, and moisturize this area because we want to keep those wrinkles away. And this is so thin, so we need that gel. And there's so much gel in these little petals. You get 40 of them in here. And um, they're just really wonderful any time of day. Even if you're wearing your makeup, just put it on. And it's going to hydrate and revive and hydrate that area. I love my eye patches. Use them anytime. And uh, talking about eye patches on that eye area where it tends to show up when we're not feeling so great and when we're tired or we haven't had enough sleep or we're not eating the right food. This is one of my um, all-time favorites. First of all, the color is so beautiful, right? I call this nap in a jar right? Because it's, it's called the Angel Smoothing Eye Gel. It's great if you are someone that suffers from allergies. You just tap it on and it calms and soothes that area, right? And you could put it on as many times as you want. When I was uh, working at, um, at my desk and working long hours in the computer all the time, you can just put a little bit and just relax and you just feel like you just took a little power nap. It's going to depuff, defresh, my husband likes to keep this in the refrigerator. He suffers from allergy in spring. And so he likes to keep it in the refrigerator for an extra soothing pampering treat. And he puts it on even when you're wearing your makeup. Of course, he doesn't wear makeup. But if you wear makeup, you can just tap it on and it will not disturb your makeup. But you're going to feel like you just had a refreshing nap as many times as you want uh, to feel that refreshing feeling. All right. Our Indulge Soothing Eye Gel. Okay, let's talk about some eye creams. We have a few. Whatever it is that you're looking for, we've got you covered in Mary Kay. Isn't that great to know? All right, so I'm going to start with the 3D eye cream in this beautiful pink color, right? It's for all skincare types, and it has a pointed applicator. When putting on eye cream, you're going to use your ring or your pinky finger, and you're going to gently tap, tap, or stipple around your eye area. Again, you can put your eye cream on even though you may already be wearing makeup because you may want that extra lift and hydration throughout the day, right? So this is our 3D eye cream. We have, of course, the repair for advanced uh, signs of aging. The advanced signs of aging is our repair. And this is our volume from eye renewal cream. This one has a special little uh, top right here. You see that little round ball is Zymax. And that actually gives you a little massage and it's also cool and refreshing. And as you're doing that, you also are pressing away the bags under your eyes, okay? And so you're just going to give yourself a little massage, okay, even here on the brow bone while you're applying your eye cream. I also like to keep, so this is right next to my husband's eye mask in the refrigerator. Why We want to give ourselves a little treat. And you're going to use your eye cream twice a day, morning and night, every day to keep the wrinkles away, to keep this area nice and firm and bright. We don't want any dark circles in that area. So we also have the men's uh, advanced eye cream. Remember, theirs is going to be formulated a little richer. Uh, but again, they're going to apply this eye cream gently ring or pinky finger None of this, but just gently stipping or tapping. And they're going to use this morning and night to be able to make sure that they are also taking care of that area. And, uh, okay, and so next, this one is also one of our original eye creams is the TimeWise uh, Firming Eye Cream. Also, you can put it on anytime. Whoops, one pump will do it. If you don't break your pump, okay, one pump will do it. And you're just going to... Tap, 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 tap. You don't need to put it right on your lid because your natural body temperature when you put it here on your brow bone will allow the product to gravitate where you need it. Firming eye cream is an all-time favorite, right? Morning and night, every single day. 
Okay. And so my last product is going to be all about kissable lips, satin lips, sugar scrub, and shea butter. Are you hungry yet? Do you want to go get some vanilla ice cream now that I talked about that? Well, shea is known to be a super, through the centuries, a great hydrator. Uh, great to moisturize all over the body. And we have our balm that has a great little slanted applicator that allows you to apply it on top of lipstick, underneath lipstick, whenever you feel that your lips need to be hydrated. It's shea. And uh, butter balm is just yummy. My son, I think when he was in kindergarten, he learned to put this on Instead of that other word, I'm not going to start with a C, it ends with a K. We don't want that. You want shea butter, which is going to naturally hydrate your lip. And um, we have our sugar scrub too. And this is a set. So a couple of times a week, you want to take the time to wet your lips, get the scrub, the shea scrub, exfoliate your lips, right? Wipe it off. And then you're going to put on the balm and leave it on. Typically, I like to do this at night because I've kind of retired and I'm resting. I'm not eating. I'm not biting on my lips. And so when I wake up in the morning, I have soft, kissable lips, right? And so this is a set. They're like a little marriage, kind of like the day and night cream. They go together to have kissable, exfoliated lips. And why do you want that? So that your lipstick products stay on better and wear better. And it's not attractive when you see the pretty color and then you see, wow, she needs a little shea butter, right? So this is going to make sure that your products last and look and wear uh, longer. Um, and it's just pampering for yourself. And then the last one, I forgot to get it, but we also have a lip primer that is also a protector. It's going to form a berry on your lips. So allow to your lipstick to wear longer, extend to wear your lipstick. And if you happen to have little telltale lines that sometimes happen when we're making this shape, the primer is going to go in and fill that in um, so that your lipstick will not bleed. Um, and it's uh, just really great for you and is age fighting. So it's also going to help with delaying the signs of aging. Okay, ladies, gosh, that was a lot of product. We went through seven different steps lots of choices depending on what your skin needs. So I hope you made some notes. I hope you learned some things. And please check with your consultant for any questions. We did a lot of products. So I'm going to encourage you to get back to your consultant and let her know, I've got to have my eye care. I've got to have my moisturizer. Oh, and Marsha said, I better wear my mask, right? And so I hope that you learned a lot. Thank you so much for joining. And back to you, Alice. Hey, so um, we have just a minute to wrap up here. We have, um, so what I want you to do is first of all, put in the chat the favorite, like your most favorite product that was shared tonight. So just type in the chat, what product was shared that's your favorite, whether you're a consultant or a guest, like what's your favorite product shared tonight? I just kind of want to see in the chat. I, I know everybody says love it all, but what's your like most favorite, can't live without, you know, it's the product that you just gotta have it. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Can't live no, without it. You're you're stranded on a desert island and you need that product. <laughs> and I'm just gonna look for some some comments for the product, your favorite product, and then also guests on here. Um, maybe I want guests to put what's a product that you learned about tonight that you had no idea, like what it did, that it existed, that Mary Kay had it. Um, so guests, uh, put a, put a, in the chat, what product you learned about, like one, one that you're now curious, like, I want to try that. All right. So some of the favorites are Maria Johnson loves her repair set and um, Jamila is the eye patches and Jamel is the um, eye makeup remover. And um, Amanda's the four in one cleanser. Yes, these, these are all amazing products. Um, and they're, mine's the charcoal mask. I like can't live without it at all. Um, never, never would go a week without using it at least twice. Um, and my computer's covering the chat. Just a second. <laughs> <laughs> I, I something just popped up and I'm like, no, I don't want to see more. Go away. 
Well, what about say, a new product? Maybe a new product that they learned about, a brand new yeah. product for the consultants okay, with the so, guests. Oh, what is my computer doing? You're Are good, you guys you're all still good. there? We can okay. still see you. You're doing good. Oh, my computer just went somewhere. I know, it's okay. Oh, okay. okay, so uh, Melody, you didn't know they had a men's line. That's great. And then let's see, anybody, any other guests? Oh, Beatrice, the biocellulose mask. Is that your favorite or one you learned about? I'm sorry. And let's see. Um, the boosters together. Yeah, a lot of people are worried about using those together, but you can. And just remember your alphabet. And that's how you know how the order to put them on. <laughs> that is really cute. The alphabet. ABC. Great. Okay, Beatrice, your favorite. Yes, that mask is, a, is awesome. And, you know, I thought, oh, use it for a special occasion when it first was introduced. And then I started seeing the results. And I thought, I'm not using this for a special occasion. It's like when you need a tan for a trip, right? You got to start way, way ahead. So why would I wait till the event? Um, Melody multi-masking. Great. Thank you. Yes. You can put multiple masks on at the same time. So we actually, that, that brings me to, um, my drawing for our guests. So if you're a guest, um, joining us tonight, you got to be present to win. So, um, type, uh, I'm a guest, I'm a guest in the chat. It'll show me your name. Cause like I can see, I know Melody's a guest of Maria and I believe Baina is on here. Um, and Carol, Carol, if just type, just type, I'm a guest, I'm a guest. Our guest, uh, our guest winner is going to win this multi-masking um, travel set tonight from uh, one of us directors. So whoever her consultant is, the director is going to take care of it. Um, so one lucky guest. Now this has both masks that I talked about. I have my little tray here and I'm knocking stuff over. <laughs> Both the masks that you can multi-mask together. The um, This little set has both of those in this box. So you're going to get to try both masks. And we still have one guest on Melody. Do we have any, any other guests? Comment now. Last chance. <laughs> Melody's like, don't comment. I want to win the prize. <laughs> it's mine. It's mine. It's mine. She's claiming it. <laughs> um, all right. Let's see. I, I'm not seeing anything new. So Melody is our winner because you must be present to win. So Melody, you will be getting this in the mail from me. And um, and then you'll have to tell your consultant what you thought of it when you multi mass. Okay. So congratulations, Melody. Um we, I know we went a little long tonight, but we had a lot to share. And which consultant had the most guests on? Which consultant had the most guests? So I know that Jamel had Carol and Maria had Melody. Do we have anybody? Anybody have a second guest? Is there another guest I don't know about that was on earlier? Maybe they had to hop off at eight o'clock. I mean, at nine. Consultants, you can just text your director which guests were on because we will be able to see this chat. All right. And I was keeping track of the chat. I'll have to go back and finish to find out who our chatty Kathy is. But just so you know, there were three in the lead. When I last checked, it was Maria, Jamel, and Jamila. So I want to give them a round of applause. It's going to be one of them for sure. <laughs> and um, and we will get our chatty Kathy winner crowned next week. Um, we will have another YouTube event for you. We have an amazing guest um, director speaker, and we want to thank you all for joining us tonight. And we will have, um, use if you have the QR code, if that's how you joined us, you can use the same code. If it's um, a YouTube link is how you joined us, it will be an updated YouTube link. So we'll make sure to get that to your consultant. You can join us next week. And, um, and then we will get these prizes in the mail. And I want to thank you all next week, same time, 8 o'clock on Wednesday night. And um, if you use the QR code, same code, right? Okay, different YouTube link. So um, QR code is kind of the easy way to go because then you don't have to think of anything new. So we're going to say good night. Good night. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. We'll see you all next week. All right.